don't know. It's just, it's, it's scary. So yeah, I mean, I just, I, yeah, I know me. I know myself the most. Like it is just, it is what it is. Um, yeah. And guys also with the GTA stuff, I know a lot of people like want to see me play. I, I understand that. And, and I'm not like completely burnt out of it. I just do think that like, sometimes I need a little break from it. Um, and it, I, I, look, I love April. I love how much you guys love April. And like, I, 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 I genuinely do. Um, but yeah, like, I think I just need some little breaks from it. Um, but yeah, the more you guys like pressure me to play, the more I will like not play. I'm like, I'm genuinely serious about this. And like, you guys have like, it's, I've been playing variety. I've been liking, I, it's, it's kind of the same. I, yeah. Like if this is how I've, my mental mentality has been, I'm, I'm just, I'm just like that with GTA. So people who are like, you guys, need, you need to play. You're, you're getting complacent. Why aren't you meeting new people? Well, I'm like, bro, I'm just not. I'm just not gonna play if if like you know what I mean those are just so I, she's a dip in dip out character I just I can't commit to like the I'm like not a main a GTA main whereas, whereas like you're used to probably watching a lot of GTA mains but I'm just not that girl and I haven't been and I don't know how many times I can say that I'm not that girl I don't know it just it is yeah, I'm not actually April Foos, guys. And, like, my life does not revolve around April Foos. I know that, like, it's rough. But, like, I deeply adore, like, her and tons of the interactions I have in roleplay. And tons of the friends that I have in RP. I'm just not always going to play it. And I need that to be just an okay thing. You know? I'm not April Foos. It can be really overwhelming for me. Yes. I don't know if you guys can understand that. Sometimes I'm in the game and I am literally suffering. I'm like, oh my God, I'm so fucking annoyed right now. Or I'm so overwhelmed by the amount of things happening. And it's like not like something I want to wake up and do every day. Like sometimes I'm just like, dude, I'm just like not comfortable. And now I'm like uncomfortable in front of my community. And I'm like doubly uncomfortable because I have to like act like I'm not uncomfortable. But I am just actively uncomfortable right now. I don't know how to like do this. And knowing that gives me a little anxiety, like logging in. I'm like, I might get one of those situations again. It might be amazing. It's like a gamble. It's a gamble for me. Sometimes RP is so cool. And sometimes I'm like, I absolutely despise this. And I do not want to be in this situation ever again. So it, it's, if you guys get over and watching it, like, bro, imagine just like, whoo. And then like someone's talking and you're like, what the fuck are you saying? Oh my God. It's like, and so sometimes I just like wake up and I just don't want to feel that way. Um, that day and sometimes I'm like it's worth it I want to take that coin flip and because because then you get days like meeting the Italians or really good talks or amazing drama like I love the Hazel stuff like the girls drama has been fun um I like I love the little pockets um but sometimes I just actually get overwhelmed and you can probably sense it like dude the the, the freaking stuff in Mount Chiliad I I was like so overwhelmed by that I was like I I can't believe I, I've been down for 20 minutes I don't know what to do I was just like and that was like my return to GTA. I was like, mm, I don't know if I'm to do this. So sometimes I'll, I'll wake up and feel like, the, feel like it. I don't know. It just feels like the pressure. Like, yeah. So it's not that like I don't think. Yeah, I don't know. I've been playing RP for a while too. And sometimes it, 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 it has dips. And some people are like, just do better then. Just be better. Be a better role player. I'm not that great of a role player guys like I can't just poof and create an amazing like I'm not as good as you know what I mean like I wish I could I wish I could and I, I wish I had that creativity but and sometimes I find it in me and sometimes I'm like trying so hard and I'm like dude I can't make this interesting this is just an objectively boring situation I'm in or like I I, I don't know I don't know how to interact sometimes I'm like trying to RP with somebody and I'm like oh we're just not really RPing that well together and that's okay just like in real life, I meet someone and I'm like, sometimes I really click with this person. And sometimes I'm like, yeah, this is okay. It's okay for that to happen. But like, I think that's just like, yeah, if I ever, I, I try, I'm trying. I don't want to complain about RP too much because I don't like where shit gets clipped. And then people are like, she has no right to speak on role play, by the way, because she is a variety streamer and that's a fair take. So I'm not complaining about the state of no pixel. That is, I'm staying away from that. I also think, yeah, I don't, I'm not going to talk about no pixel. This is just my take on role play and where I am in for Leslie in April. That's like, you know, I don't even know what, if it's still grindy, whatever, but it's just like, yeah. And so I no, I love when RP is good. It is so good. And you know that like I'm dying laughing 
the the the, the, the stuff with pigeon in the apartment the the italians there's just so many amazing things just in 4.0 just in 4.0 um that i've adored and it's like it's just like sometimes i don't know if i'm gonna what i'm gonna get and maybe that's the beauty of it that is probably the beauty of it but yeah i just get a bit anxious sometimes yeah it, i just get i just get anxious yeah highs and lows and sometimes i'm just more prepared to deal with that and i'm like who cares so i'm like yeah i get anxious and whatever log in anyway uh, but some days I'm like, I don't know if I want to deal with that. And I get like stressed. Um, but yeah, like I, 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 uh, that's kind of where I'm at. So I don't know. Like I've been thinking about maybe I'd like announce an official hiatus and then I'll come back in a, in a couple months or a month or two, just so people officially stop asking. So I can be like, Hey, I'm taking two months off. I'm not playing GTA for two months. Um, and see where that takes me. I was thinking about that. Maybe I'll do that. Um, but it's just like, some days I don't want to go live just because I don't want to deal with people being like, oh, no RP. And I'm like, do you know what I mean? It's just like, I don't know. It just, it's just rough. Yeah, dude, the day with Paige was so fun. You don't have to remind me the great things about RP. You do not have to tell me that. I loved the, I, I loved it. I was there. I was role playing with those people and I had the best time. And I was like, dude, those were amazing times. Like, you do not have to tell me when what days were fun like I loved those days um it's 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 the days that aren't those days or it's the community or it's yeah but so I'm like dude I I'm like yeah I just it's just much much and because I always feel like if I don't play RP it's like I don't know I just feel like I'm not it's like everything else is just not I don't know. I just, I'm more than my GTA RP character. And I want people to know that. And it's just annoying. Like, I don't live to be April. And I don't know. It's, it's like, I love how much you guys love her. But sometimes that fucking frustrates me. Like, dude. I don't know. And then, like, yeah, whatever. Okay, anyways. It's just, yeah. Also, you guys, the community is so bad. Like, I just, I hate the GTA RP community. It's so awful. Like, I, I see so much, and I'm like, dude, what? Like, oh, and there's so much hate for me and my character, and I'm like, bro, what? I don't understand. So, I just, it's something just, it's hard to just show up and please everybody. Like, and act like, I don't know. So, I'll think about it, but I probably will announce an official hiatus from RP. Just for my own mental, just so I don't have to deal with people asking about her. I love April, you guys know, but like, it's just too much. And it's just been putting me in a really bleh mindset. So, um, yeah, I don't know if you guys, yeah, like, there's so much positivity. I'm not saying there's not a lot of like, uh, not a lot of great people in RP. Um, and obviously like so many, like I love so many people. The positives are the obvious part. But we can't act like we're, like, blind to all the negativity. Like, I I'm only human, bro. And, like, a lot of you guys are stronger than I could ever be. Um, but, like, yeah. Um, at some point, it's just going to, like, eat at me. And having to deal with whatever people are saying. It's very, like, just block it out, Leslie. Please, just block it out. We're yeah, I try. And some days I'm really good at it. Some days I'm like, I literally do not care what people say. I do not care. And I genuinely don't. And then the other days I wake up and I'm like, ow. Ow. And, and it affects me. And I, I don't know. That's, I mean, that's not, that's not just an RP, but I guess it's just like amplified. So anyways, um, there's tons of amazing RPers who you guys will be able to watch. Um, but yeah, it is just one of those things that like, I feel like, yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I'm human. Um, and that's why I'm like inc super encouraged like my friends who still love RP to please play RP because there's such a like if you're not burnt by it or those comments genuinely don't get to you and all that like that then like then the RP is so freaking worth because there's so many amazing people in it I have met so many great people you guys know I'm like like I like literally log in for them like that is what I log in for is like I like tank all the whatever comments and all that what the, all of the potential for this awkward situation or that um, for, for people, uh, that I've met and yeah, cause they're so great. Anyways, 
So that is that is that. I'll think about it. I mean, like, uh, I'm not sure. But yeah, I've been thinking about hiatus. Just like, or not, not like, I don't know how long, but just like an official. I'm not, I'm taking a break. So you guys know I'm logging in. It is not going to be RP because I just, that is just how my brain is right now. Every day is, I'm like, I should. I really should. I should. I have to. Okay, I'm going to. Like, I, and then that just causes me to like resent it. That makes sense versus like, I can't wait to play it. I used to feel that way. And now I'm like, I really should. And because of that, like, and then sometimes it's rewarding and sometimes it's like, damn, I shouldn't have. Yeah. So that is that. It became a bit of a chore. Yeah. And that's what I didn't want. And that's really what I didn't want. But it, it started fine. But up, up, over time. And also a lot of people just, they, yeah, I've just, it's just taken a toll. It's taken a toll on me. And I know that it's really easy to take on that fact and just be like, yeah, wow, poor streamer can't just play a game. Wow. What an easy thing she does and she can't even do that. Or wow, how complacent she's gotten. I've seen it all, guys. Okay, I've seen all the comments. Uh, that's why I even hesitate to sometimes tweet out like I'm not going to stream that day. It's like, you've got the easiest job in the world and you're not going to stream. Embarrassing, right? I'm like, okay. You know what I mean? Like, bruh. So I just don't. I just don't. I just don't tweet. I just don't post. Because I'm like, if I don't put that out there, then I don't have to see that. And if I don't see that, like, that's literally, like, how I stay sane. It's like, how to stay sane in this industry? You just don't output. Because then you can't really get the response. But, like, yeah, I've had an amazing, I've had an amazing time. Like, the positives are really obvious. Uh, It's just the pressure, like, to always output. Like, GTA can be, like, the worst and I just, I love it. Like, I, you know how I love GTA. Like, it's my favorite game of all time that I've ever played. Ever. So, like, it just, I don't know. I, I, it's just such an incredible vehicle for so many good interactions. And that's what we all live for. We love it. We love it. I love watching it. I love it. But then you get too into it and then you see it and then you're like oh people hate me (laughs) they hate what I'm doing or they're too obsessed with what I'm doing and they're you know and it it, it doesn't stop and it's like years of it and you're like oh it doesn't matter how much I tell people um it doesn't matter how much I tell people not to do something there will always be a people who do it after years and years and years and you take it because it's so fun and you're just like I don't know. It just so I guess it's just been this push and pull relationship with GTA and and I don't know how to like deal with it. Like I I love it so much, but then I hate it so much. It's so overwhelming. I'm like I don't know. It's like I can't make a decision. It's like something I love so much that I can't take a break from it, but I have to. <laughs> that, that's what I was like. God, it's like so annoying. And th- what makes it worse is that you guys love it. The people that I am putting out God for love it the most. <laughs> so then when I want to like do anything, like I, like, it's literally because you guys love her so much that I'm like, this is what I do. <laughs> that's like, that's, it's, it's literally because you guys love her so much that like I, <laughs> I feel so bad. It's like I'm punishing the, the people that are the best to me that's why i don't want to take breaks from like april it's because the people who like there's it's like this i'm letting the smallest percentage of people or not even a small percentage, but i'm letting these like a small percentage and i'm punishing like the people who are so good so i push through and i you know what i mean i don't know it's not that you you know I, i don't think you support me but it's like do you get it it's like there's there's a huge chunk of you guys who watch gta and and love it and are so great and they're like i think i something funny is happening and you guys are like literally it's like i'm so happy i'm streaming this this is the funniest thing and i'm just having a great time or you guys are like eating it up and i'm eating it up and i'm like you know what i mean like i'm just yip yapping going on or yappy and then you guys are like enjoying it just as much if not more than me and those are like that's literally what I live for it's just the yeah. 
I don't know how to express it. So then I feel like, but just like for my own, like, who, like I, maybe I just need to find my right spot with it because I love it. But this is also what variety streamers like suffer from because we don't log in every day. It's hard for us to pick up on a story um, and it can feel like we are very complacent. I'm so privileged to get to play a variety of games, you know, like I'm so happy I can and I'll never like, I don't know, never be able to thank you guys enough for that. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. It's like, I don't even feel like the chat is bad during GTA. It's not even that. It's, it's, it's just like, a, I don't know. It's just a couple comments. Anyways, um, yeah, that's, that's why. And some days I just feel like this dread of like, should I? I have to. I really should. But I, I don't want to feel that. I want to feel like, and I feel horrible for not being able to continue a story. And I'm like, God, what's wrong with me? Just wake up, fit, continue this story, and then pick up on more storylines. Um, and stuff like that. Anyways, uh, I don't know. That's it. That's it. But the people here, I swear, it's like I'm preaching to the choir. Does that make sense? Like, the people here are not the problem. <laughs> or, like, most of you are not the problem. It's just a couple, and I'll see it, and it'll piss me off. It's like, you can criticize April, and that's totally fine. But it's more of just, like, what there's just, there's just, like, uh, I don't know. I don't describe. But, like, it, it takes a toll on me. I'll be like, ugh. And then I'll, like... Imagine, like, you get offline and people are like, oh, I hate April for this. I hate her for that. Or why doesn't she do this? She should do this. Oh, my God. This arc needs to happen. Blah, 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 blah. And I'm just like, ah, I don't know. You know? And sometimes it does. I'm like, oh, so disappointed today. Oh, my God. This should have happened. Why is this happening right now? And I'm like, you know, and, like, there's all these voices. And I'm like, oh, my God. Every decision I make, people are going to stress over. I'm going to stress over. Blah, blah, blah. Like, I did this wrong. I made the wrong decision. Blah, blah, blah. And I'm also I'll just, I'm unfazed. <laughs> I have to act unfazed. I don't care. I don't care about anything. Because I do feel like that is one of the ways that GTA RPers like tank it. They, they the, the, the ones that can do it every day are the ones who have mastered the art of not caring. And sometimes I, I do it. Sometimes I really have. And actually I've gotten to a point where I have seen like people just flaming April. Like they're just like, holy God, I hate April Foos. And I have felt nothing from it. I'm like, yeah, that's fair. You can. And sometimes I hate her. So I'm like, damn, she is a, that is awful. She's an awful person, you know? <laughs> but, um, anyways, I want it to be at a fun spot and I, and I, and I still, I'm there, but like sometimes I'm just overwhelmed by it. So, you know, maybe take a little break, maybe just even like two weeks, just a little two weeks. And sometimes I already took a two week break. Um, let me think about it. I'll update you guys with my feelings. My period's probably coming. <laughs> Anyways, no, yeah. Tina would be proud of you for the tears today. <laughs> yeah, she would. She would. I'm expressing myself. 